Hello, my name is Miguel and today I'm going to make for you pumpkin seasoned rice seasoned rice so we're going to use a tablespoon of salt or a teaspoon alright, salt I'll tell you what the ingredients is we're going to use butter um, pumpkin I'm using white rice although I prefer to use gold brown rice but I'm doing this for the website so two cups of white rice I'm using garlic onion half of an onion and thyme and I can find it I'll probably throw two fermented seed in there and half of a scotch bonnet pepper so this is quarter pound of pumpkin so peel it peel the skin off it's a dirt right there look at I'm peeling it off oh boy so peel this out peel this out You see, with pumpkin rice, you don't want plenty of pumpkin in it. You're just flavoring it. You don't want to use a lot of pumpkin, like you're cooking food with the rice. No, it's just a flavor, a flavoring mechanism. All right, so peel off the skin and put this aside. We're gonna we're gonna blend it. All right, so I'm gonna put this aside until we're ready to to grate it. I said blend earlier. We're gonna grater it. We're gonna grate it. Grater it. Alright. Add your rice. I'm measuring rice to cook it. I, hard, I never measure rice. I'm just doing this for you guys. So you have the right proportion. But it feels strange to measure rice. So that's two cups. Two cups. So now we're going to rinse this. So add water. And just rinse it. Rice is grainy, broken pieces, small, broken up. So once you and rinse it, just remove the water. So you just put that aside until we're ready. Because I'm using this pot to cook in, just transfer the rice in a different container. Just put the rice in a different container. Or you could have washed it in a container that you're not gonna cook with. No. Great, it's great, it's great, it's great, it's great. Alright, you can just put this aside. I can leave it there. You can put it in. Great, 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 great,
So let's wash this off and put that aside to rest. So this is quarter pound grated. Now take two garlic cloves. And, and smash them. Sometimes I say mash but smash, smash them as soon as you can get your skins out so just crush, crush, crush the garlic right. I'm gonna put a piece of ginger in this but it's optional small piece After 30 seconds, add one tablespoon of oil. Put the stove gauge on six. Gauge on six all this time, all the time. Add salt and the butter. All right. The water is not so hot, but this is a gauge that you can use. The tip of the rice to the top of your finger in here is a guide, but we use two and a half cups of water. So stir that in. So two pimento seeds, man. And 
cover it. Cover it slightly. Cover it slightly. Once it once it's hot, put the stove's gauge on four. And cover it slightly. And let it cook. Just allow that to cook. Once it come to a once the rice is dried out, we're gonna turn it down and, and cover it with properly. Just three minutes, just stir it in. To make sure it's not sticky. You see, the best there's you can cut, you can dice the pumpkin to to have the effect, but. I was told by a good friend of mine that the same person, the best way to cook pumpkin rice is to grate it. Grate it. The same person told me that the best way to cook turkey neck is to cut it fine. And that was a, that was a very good tip. So we're going to see how it's going to turn out together. Now after about six minutes, turn the stove on very low. Now after 10 minutes, we're going to rotate the rice. You should look under the fire and make sure it's not out. it bring the bottom to the top I use two and a half cups of water. Um, use the finger guide that I told you, and if it's less, put it up. It might be you might need to use three cups, but for the recipe, I'm gonna put two and a half cups. But remember, use the finger guide. The tip of the rice and the water, the top of the rock. Water here. Stop right here. And why I recommend using the two and a half cups because once because once the water is dried out, once the water is dried out, the steam will finish cooking it. But in a, at least with white rice, because white rice cooks so easily these days. Now after, okay, let's throw it here. Let's do it. Give it a light stir. This is cooked. Turn it over. Taste your handiwork. Time leave. 
I can smell the pumpkin rice. So this is pumpkin rice. So this took 35 minutes in total. So it took 5 minutes on flame 6 for the rice to dry out. It took another 15 minutes for the first set of steam and then I stir the rice and then I'll cover it again and then let it stay for another 15 minutes. So in all it took 35 minutes. So you just cover this, not with this, until you are ready to serve. Pumpkin seasoned rice. Sampling two in one, the pumpkin rice. Oh, cool. This one is clean and nice. Wow, just this one. This is different if you want something different. <laughs> 